Good morning. It's almost Christmas. We got Mandy, we got Haley, and guys, we're gonna be bringing you on the best Christmas vlog ever. Why? Because it's glute day. And we're gonna slay the booty. So welcome to the vlog. I'm gonna be running this a little bit backwards Because I tried to like record the core of this vlog And then I tried to record stuff after and I didn't end up recording enough to make it a full vlog So we're gonna roll backwards So you'll see the day getting lighter and it'll be interesting But I want to give you guys the best Christmas glute workout you've ever seen so that will be at the end of this video, so stay tuned and enjoy the Christmas Booty Day vlog. I feel like I might be the only one here, but I just don't like wrapping Christmas presents. It's only because I'm bad at it. For now, I want to show you my dinner because it's so good. So this might look like a mess, but it's so good. So what I did is I cooked this butternut squash. I cooked, put, cut into tiny little cubes and I basically like marinated it for 24 hours. I had a sweet and a savory and then my mom cooked them together and the flavors actually go really well together. So I cubed them up and I put coconut oil spray on them and then I put, on the sweet one, I put cinnamon and I put pumpkin pie spice and stevia. And then on the savory ones, I put, I believe the coconut oil spray, I did salt, I did rosemary. Oh, I did Tony Cherries. And it ended up coming out so good. So you, then you cube them up tiny and roast them in the oven for on 425 for 30 minutes. And they come out perfect. So And they taste really good in salad or by themselves with syrup. But I'm having them in salad with some shredded chicken. That's crockpot chicken. Um, and a bunch of different veggies. So I have like lettuce, pickles, cucumbers, peppers. And then on top I put olive oil. I measured my olive oil for my fats. Olive oil... And I think I put some butter spray, and that's about it. What did you think of my idea of us uh, meeting in the Maybe please come You're singing deck the home. It's not like Christmas. I'm putting coconut oil on my toast because I need fat today. I'm low on my fats, and that's the best coconut oil because it tastes like coconuts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like so it good. So I'm putting coconut oil, cinnamon, yep. and then I'm gonna put some sugar you know, on just, it. When she she just takes a spoonful and eats it. Yeah, but it's nasty. Actually, but it's pretty. I try it. It's this good. well, this kind is good. Normal kind just tastes like lard, unless you put salt or like white cheddar seasoning on it. But this is gonna be super tasty. Oh. Sorry, guys. I didn't bring my camera because Mandy and I were running all over the place. I had so many errands to run to get last minute Christmas presents. It was snowing like crazy so I didn't want to vlog while I was driving. Y'all know I want to stay alive for you. So I'm finally back home. Still got the light up necklace but back home I'm actually not staying at Mandy's tonight. That was the original plan. I was also going to have an event for my clients tomorrow, Lifting Lean Live. But I have to reschedule because in New Hampshire, the weather is unpredictable and it's going to be all ice tomorrow. This video is going to be mainly focused on that glute workout, so hopefully you guys can go copy that. I'm also starting to create glute-focused programs, and this is me kind of testing out things, seeing what I, what I like to pair before I give it to somebody else. And I actually have one client who's starting hers in January, so if you guys want to hop on that train, email me. As always, regofitness at gmail.com. And 
that's going to be a 12, I think it's a 12 week program probably, glute builder. It obviously takes a really long time to build your glutes, but it's a start. So we ready? Haley, you ready? Yeah, oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, we try. <laughs> so we are hitting glutes and hamstrings today. We started with about 15 minutes of warm up cardio, did some hit. I still do 30 minutes a day hit cardio even though I'm about a month out of my contest. So the three of us are hitting this day. So we want to bring you with us. So we're going to start with a pull through, supersetted with, what'd she say? A sumo, we're supersetting the sumo. I'm going to try to talk you through it between each exercise instead of doing a voiceover. So we'll see how that goes, but we can see it. really focusing on the squeeze at the end of the pull throughs and so that was a really good activator. And then we moved on to a wide leg press super excited with Steve hamstring curls and the wide leg press is really really good if even with the light weight you just have to focus so intensely on squeezing your glutes at the end of that movement and not putting the tension in your quad. That in itself is a challenge let alone the actual movement so I also banded them to put that added tension on the glute medius. <laughs> Moving on to squats. That's gonna be a sick clip. Squatting with the Santa hat on is actually really hard. The band makes it really, really hard. So staying right around 135 today, no higher for me. It's not a heavy squat day. Trying to keep ranges around 8 to 10. And I think we're gonna do some sumo deadlifts too. So it's a good day so far. Not feeling strong, but Frank, very my muscles connected. So the last superset we are doing is kickbacks, superset with sumo pulse squats. They're actually quite a lot harder than they look, especially if you're actually connecting your mind, your muscle, and you're actually bouncing through it. If you really try to push out from your heels, and you use your glutes, and squeeze to the top. So, same with kickbacks. Control the movement, squeeze your glutes at the end. You shouldn't feel this too much in your lower back. If you do, reset, lean forward a little bit more, and try to just use your glute. Hi guys, sorry to end that workout so abruptly. I think there was people trying to talk to us or something and I just got distracted. But let me know if you guys liked that glute workout. It was absolutely killer. My The like outer part of my glutes, just by adding the band changes it so much. It's not like just band work is gonna like help your butt grow by itself, but if you add it to really heavy exercises that you already do or compound movements, it's a whole new level of soreness. So <laughs> it's intense. So try that workout, let me know how it goes. If you are interested in having me write you a glute program, let me know, email me. Go on my website and sign up for a console and we'll go through that glute program and see if that's what will work best for you. I did just launch the website and I'm super excited about it so if you haven't seen it, go check it out. I will link it here and then I'll link it below. Please let me know some feedback on that and on this video and I'm gonna try to bring you guys, I think the next vlog is gonna be, I already recorded like three vlogs so I have to edit them and get them up. So hopefully I'll be getting back to three videos a week but for now, this was the video I was so looking forward to with Mandy and Haley. So let me know if you guys have any questions. Thank you for watching. Please like this video. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Merry Christmas.